All right, guys, the United States reacts here. It's reacting to Fullman Alchemist Brotherhood episode five. And the fifth episode is Reign of Sorrows. Okay, now. Okay, now. These are these are sad titles. These are very sad titles. But let's get straight into it. Like, share, subscribe, and know what about. Alchemy, the science of understanding, deconstructing, and reconstructing matter. However, it is not an all-powerful art. My it's neck is on pain bows. out of nothing. If one wishes to obtain something, something of equal value must be given. This is the law of equivalent exchange, the basis of all alchemy. In accordance with this law, there is a taboo among alchemists. Human transmutation is strictly forbidden. But what Had a whole concert. In order to learn more in the about intro. the field of bioalchemy, Ed and Al visited the home of Shao Tucker, the sewing life alchemist. There, they befriended Tucker's young daughter, Nina, and her dog, Alexander. The day of Tucker's annual state alchemist certification assessment was drawing near. In his desperation to pass, he used Nina and Alexander to create a talking chimera. <sighs> Knowing that nothing he did could ever change Nina back, Ed was grief-stricken at his own powerlessness. you very much that's an amazing thing you did creating something as neat as this takes talent but if you can do that why couldn't you make mommy better Ed? big brother let's play that's messed up brother are you all right you were dreaming what happened to Tucker and Nina? Uh, Mr. Tucker was scheduled to be stripped of his certification he and died. stand trial for what he did to Nina. But they're both dead. Dead? That's wild. You'll find out anyway, so I might as well tell you. They've been murdered. They? How? By who? We don't know. I was just heading over to the scene now. We're coming with you. No. Why not? You don't need to see this. Yeah, it is pretty crazy, though. He's always one step ahead of us. We better catch up to him quickly because of the way things are going. You sound as though you were expecting this. <laughs> Fill me in. God has given us a great trial, my children. Wicked heathens have spread insidious rumors trying to shake our faith. And now the military seeks to oppress us. But we must hold tight to our faith. The time has come to rise up, weapon in hand, and fight in the name of the great god Leto. Yeah! We fight under the protection of Leto. Down with heathens and heresy. No, don't be fooled. But if you insist, this time around I'll go with the younger, younger cuter model. What do you say? <laughs> that was fire. A, a monster! What's going on here? Leto what got beat done? up. What have you done with the real Father Cornello? It's your call. He said I was a monster. I think that's quite rude, don't you? Can I eat him? Can I? <laughs> oh, hey, did you hear the news? Shao Tucker, that alchemist in East City? He's dead. Tucker? Why should we care about a little nothing like him? Because it was him who was responsible for the murder. Speaking of East City, isn't that where the Flame Colonel's staying right now? Yeah, and apparently the Full Metal Brat's there, too. Oh, is he? As furious as I am that he interfered with our work here, we can't very well let him die. He's an important sacrifice. Very interesting. Ew, that was so yummy! We'll find some way of handling They're this real situation. villains, and I like it. The other one we were speaking of. What was his name? Scar. Because of his face? Yeah, we don't really know anything else about him, so that's what we're calling him. Our target is both unidentified and elusive. The only information we've been able to obtain about him is that he has a large scar on his forehead. Yes, I've heard stories about that man. That's who you're trying to hunt down? By order of the Military Police Command Center. Meanwhile, all my other work is piling up. I have to move. Now! Let's go out! Run for it! <laughs> Don't. That's what's 
that? Some generals out there. Uh, uh. The weapons, dude. Who are you anyway? Why are you after us? As long as there are creators like you in the world, there must also be destroyers. It looks like we're gonna Equal have to fight. all over again. Gutsy one, aren't you? But. <laughs> Slow. Jesus Christ. Full metal alchemist. Boy. There's nothing inside. You bastard. Yeah, we gonna have to strap after that, I ain't gonna lie. You're too slow. Damn it! And I'll be alarm. Then that explains why my attacks didn't do the damage I expected. Most unusual. Brother, oh yeah, he's going no, crazy. Just run away. You to idiot! Not happen. I'm not gonna leave you behind, huh? Fat, you press fat. your hands together to make a ring and then you perform transmutation. Now I see. Ah! Then I will have to start by destroying this abhorrent right arm of yours. I mean, really destroy the arm. It's only episode five. Y'all need to chill. be able to use your heretics alchemy <laughs> I will give you a moment to pray to God Brother! Brother! Wow Brother! unfortunately people I only wait though I think like to pray to obviously uh, alchemy am I the only one you're trying to kill today or are you going after my brother Al too if he interferes I will <laughs> that's enough you won't be killing anybody else today, Scar. I'm up. taking you into custody, or you <laughs> will answer for the murders there. of at least ten state alchemists. Alchemists alter things from their natural form, perverting them to something else, something grotesque. They profane God, the true creator of all things. As an agent of God, I am here to hand down his judgment. If you interfere, I will eliminate you as well. Oh, is that right? <laughs> You guys stay out of it. Colonel Mustang, sir! Colonel Mustang. He own one, ain't he? So this is the flame, Alchemist. Volunteering yourself to receive judgment. This is truly an auspicious day. So you know who I am, and you still want to challenge me. Bad decision. <laughs> You know as well as I do, you're useless on rainy days. Please stay back. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot. It makes it's a lot of sense. Spark going when it's raining, huh? It is fortunate that you can't create your blasphemous flame state, Alchemist. Or I will destroy all who interfere with my mission right here and now. I'd like to see you try it. A newcomer. You have to be quick to avoid my fist. Not bad. Not bad at all. You said you were going to destroy us all. In that case, why don't you start by defeating me? We'll see how you fare against the strong arm alchemist, Alex Louise Armstrong. Yeah, One hit, he's probably out there, John. God is putting them in my path for me. Not backing down? In that case, your courage will earn you a demonstration. I'll show you the art of alchemy that has been passed down the Armstrong family for generations. Let's see, my boy. man who murdered Mr. Tucker and his daughter. True. Come on, let's it's do it. Major, watch what you're doing. We don't want to destroy the city, do we? What do you mean? Destruction and creation are two sides of the same coin. Thanks. And now we know he's just fallen. What does that even mean? 
The Ishvalans were a race of people who lived to the east of us. They believed that their god Ishvala was the one absolute creator. Even after they were annexed into the country, there were still conflicts between us and them. Then, 13 years ago, a military officer accidentally shot and killed an Ishvalan child. And that led to a full-blown civil war. Oh god, oh god. One uprising led to another, and before long, the rebellion had spread to the whole eastern sector. After seven years of this, an order came down from the military high command to exterminate Ishval. Many state alchemists were brought in to act as human weapons. Needless to say, this is why. the state alchemists produced striking results. That man is an Ishbalan survivor. In a sense, his revenge is justified. <laughs> no Absolutely. Way. There's no justification for taking revenge on people who had nothing to do with it. He's just dressing his ugly lust for vengeance in the mantle of his god and calling himself an agent of justice. Cap. Still, the Cap. fact is, he's coming at us with Cap. full force. We can't let ourselves be killed for Cap. his cause. Next time, there will be no more talk. Got it? Yes, yes sir. Well, Ed, Alphonse, what are you two going to do now? What's the plan? Cap. We're going to keep moving. We can't just sit around, not as long as we're still alive. Brother. Before we can make any headway on getting your body back, we have to get my arm back to normal. Mm -hmm. After all, I'm the only one who knows how to bond your soul to the armor. Uh -huh. We've got no choice. It's been a long time. We need to pay a visit to our mechanic. They got a whole mechanic. Um, uh, he has the worst logic of all time. If the uprising happened because you, your people literally killed a child and then it, the rebellion started getting super, like, large, the entire the origin of it was correct. Like, you're not about to just take out one of our children and then think nothing gonna happen. And I don't even care if you don't have nothing to do with it. I'm going after you too, my boy. <sighs> I don't need to be justified. I'm going to do whatever I'm going to do, and it's going to be done. You know what I mean? I don't need to justify or blah, blah, blah. Like, <sighs> what a great character. Oh, blah. But that was some of the dumbest things I've ever heard in my life. The um, sins of the father are passed down to the sins of the son. <laughs> I'm asleep. Are passed down to the son, my boy. I hold 100% grudges 24-7. So... But yeah, guys, that was my reaction to episode 5 of Fullmetal Alchemist Brotherhood. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. See you guys in the next reaction video. The Dionysus is out. Peace.